Alright, hey guys, this is the first key in Jacob's territory. It's gonna be west of Cedar Lake. Um, I haven't explored much, but basically I want you to find this river flow, and then you're gonna find that river flow leading towards the lake, and then you're gonna kinda see, if you're up in the air, you'll see the doors. If you're not, you can take a boat, or you can hike up. You can grapple up there for sure. But what I did was I flew up, and you're gonna see a kind of like a tree house, kind of not, it's really small looking. I wouldn't really consider it a tree house. But then you see the bunker doors. Once again, I want you to look for Cedar Lake. I want you to look for a river flow and a tiny little mountain up there. And put your waypoint right there and you're gonna see a tree house. And then you're also gonna see a snake. No, I'm kidding, probably not. And then you're gonna see the green bunker doors. You're gonna go there, open those up. And I already found the key earlier and I forgot to record it. So you're just gonna head in there and I'm gonna show you where the shelf is, where it is. Not there. And it should be right there where my gun is aiming at, right there. This is the first lighter for Jacob's territory. So the second lighter at Calic Bay, I hope I said that right. But basically, you're going to be by this bridge area where I kind of found it. And you can also see like this docking area where my waypoint was. You can look for that. I'm sure your map will be a lot clearer than mine. I just restarted the whole game. If you're flying, it'd be easy to spot, but you can also drive in. That's also easy to spot. But basically right now, I can already see the green bunker doors. You can see the docking area to the left of me. You can kind of use that as a waypoint to help out. If not, you can use the roads that I showed on the map right there to figure it out. And then once I finally land, you're going to see like kind of like a little shed area or whatever. And then you're also going to see some dead bodies. So that's when you know you're in the right place. And then here we got the green bunker doors with a little bit of blood on it, you know, whatever. Some Halloween decorations up in here. I'm just kidding. But anyway, you're going to head in. You can see that big old flag. Some dead guy. I don't know what happened. I don't know. Sounds like they had a good time here. You can grab whatever you want. Usually these have like, yeah, they're stashed with stuff you need, whatever. And you're going to head past these doors and then head past the next set of doors as well. There's nothing here, but I mean, you can search around, whatever. And then it's going to be right there on that table next to that tiny little TV in that rocking chair. And there you go. Alright, so the third lighter should be really easy to find. You've probably already been to the Elliot residence. If not, it should be you should be real close to the river. Also, there's a road right there with the bridge that'd be easy to spot. And also there's the Fang Center over there. The big burger. Yeah, you it should be this should be the easiest one you could find. Basically I just flew in. And I landed right there and then what you want to do actually I mean you could do either way but you want to find the bunker first here I'll show you on the map again sorry and then you want to, or you could find go in the house either one I went for the bunker and you're gonna go to the bunker right here with the American flag shoot the lock on it
And then you're gonna end up going down there and you're gonna find out that the door is locked. You need a key. And so what you're gonna wanna do is actually go back up yeah, you're going to want to head up, and then what you want to do is hop in the front where it says Resist Jacob. You can go through this bedroom door with the American flag, and there's a comic book there that you can collect. And then you're going to go straight through the hallway to the bathroom, climb through that window, and then climb through this window, which is like an office-looking whatever weird place. And then you're going to go down the stairs, and you're going to enter this weird kitchen and there's a dead body and there's that key and you're gonna want to go back the same way or whatever way you came out or came in there and you're just gonna watch out for peggies um i think they show up regardless because they know you're out there trying to get the key basically what you want to do is kill them off and then you can head down in the bunker Now we're heading down and basically that key should work for you and it should be right there with a bunch of other stuff and, and there's the third lighter for you. The last lighter is easy to find as well. It's at the Whitetail Park Visitor Center. It should also show up on your map once you arrive close to the area. There's also a windy road that I'll zoom in right here that you can kind of spot out. Also by a lake area as well, mountain area. But once you get there, it should show up on your map. There's also a bridge to the left of it. I blew in again. You can kind of see, you know, a bunch of mountains. And then there's a road that leads to it. But it should be pretty obvious. There's a little bridge I was talking about in that road earlier on the map. And then there you go. Once you get close enough, it'll show up on your map. And then you're going to go up these stairs. And you're not going to go in the first door right here. You're actually going to go past that to the second door where it says information center. And then you're going to turn over here to the left. You're going to see that last key, or the lighter, and that should do it for you.